Come home, what you gonna be? Uh, three. We had a, a three year old. His mother have already conditioned him that he cannot have birthday cake when he go to birthday parties. So his birthday was coming up. And this mother searched and searched and searched because she didn't want her son to have a birthday party. And he could just look at a cake and his head as a three or four year old knew that he couldn't eat cake. That little kid came in with us, ordered the birthday cake. We made a picture of his cake, of the, a black and white copy of the cake. This little kid had that picture of his cake for 30 days out because the mother started searching for it. She said when I went to deliver the cake to him, he slept with that picture for 30 days because he knew at the end of 30 days that he would have cake for the first time. So that's why it matters. Oh, oh, okay. Look at your cake. That looks so you great. You want to have some now? Mm. You want to get some now, big guy? <laughs> My name is Dennis Stanley with Chantel's Cakes and Pastries. I'm the owner of here in Sterling, Virginia. We decided that we will start customizing a lot of our cakes to cater to a lot of clients that had food allergies. I could put you a cake on the table that has no flour on it, with flour on it, then the cake you can have you blindfold, you wouldn't know the difference. A lady came in to pick up the cake, got her a little six inch cake, and she opened up the box and started crying. And me, knowing it was an allergy cake, she opened up the box and started crying. I said, man, what's wrong? I can redo it. She said, you don't understand. I said, well, man, I can fix your cake. She said, you don't understand. This is the first time I've had cake, and she was about 40 years old. I had another story where a lady came in and brought her son's birthday cake. Two sons had allergies. One had one allergy, and one had another. When she walked in the door, she ordered her cake, and then she just sat down in the middle floor and started crying because her kids are like seven, eight years old now and they can finally eat their cake at their birthday party. We sent some cakes to Oprah. So we did do some cakes with her. President Obama's daughter, Sasha, has one of my cakes that was flew on Air Force went out to California for her birthday party because she was on tour with him and President Obama wanted her to have a cake. So they took the cake from here on Air Force One to uh, California with that. If we do a show, or I would love to do a show, I would want it to be different. I wouldn't want to do a show where it's just repetitious from what someone else is doing. I would want to do a show where it's more like an educational show, where a lot of clients that have food allergies, or even if it's not a food allergy, if we teach someone how to do something, even eat healthy, with a lot, with, to live longer. It's cakes and patience that matter. Yes, it's, 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 and it's the, it's the love that we put into it and the love that we get back from clients. There's your cake. Your special occasion.